Today we're going to make a travel card. So for this travel card, I've cut out a circular shape, handmade card. You can get papers or cards like this from Mr. Rabbit stores. You have to make a circle. I've used a loop ring here to make a circle. There's a blue color card. So I've made a similar white color card for the back side. So now for this, I'm making a travel card to Germany. So I've drawn the outline of the German map over here. I'll show it to you. I'm going to draw a plane and then cut it out. I'm going to color it completely black. I thought this would give a nice and look to the card. Now you can also print out uh, objects or items that you want and then you can cut it out. I generally prefer drawing out things and then cutting it out. Once it's ready, you just need to cut it out, leaving a small white border around the plane so that it highlights the plane. Now for the wordings also, I've done the same thing. I've written out the wordings and then cut them out. I'm going to stick everything using a double-sided tape. I'm going to write down German here and then cut it out in the same way. Place it accordingly and then just stick them out with the double sided tape. You can even use your own ideas and use other items to stick on the card and then create your own travel gift card. Sticking it with the double sided tape gives it a more embossed effect and I think this one makes the card really good because of the double sided tape you know the projection and all it gives it a real good look now the front side of the card is ready the white side is for the back part now for the inside portion I'm going to use the green color circular cutout I've used colored um, a4 sheets for everything and for the front and back part alone I've used uh, <coughs> scrapbook cards now I'm drawing out the flag again as I told you earlier I'm drawing out all the items necessary for the card and then I'm coloring it out and then cutting it out and then pasting it with the double sided tape there after coloring I cut them out and then I stuck it. I wasn't able to take out the video while sticking it. Outlines of the cutouts that I'm going to do. For this one, I'm going to use a toothpick and then stick it with the cellophane tape behind and then arrange them on the card. I'm doing this on the back side of the front portion. I'm also adding a bow on top of the ribbon. I'm securing the center of the bow with a stapler pin. You can also use a glue gun to secure the center portion. Now I've pasted the toothpicks with the cutout with a glue gun. And top of that, I'm going to place the polka dotted ribbon. I haven't cut out the excess of the ribbon. I thought it would be much more better if we first stick the ribbon and then cut out the excess. It gives it a much neater look.
Now I'm going to place the bow on top of the ribbon with a hot glue gun. I also thought it would be better if we add a button to the center portion of the bow. I think now it looks much more better than before. Now we can cut out the excess of the ribbon. This is how the finished card looks. You can see that the double sided tape is giving an effect to the card which makes it look even more better. This is how the inner portion looks. I'll turn it now. There you go. This was done for one of my cousins who was traveling to Germany. So I've added a few items that is relevant to Germany. I haven't added much wordings inside the card. Just simple quotes and messages. If you want, you can add a lot of messages inside the card. Hope you guys like it. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.